Welcome, welcome, welcome to probably one of the best animes in the season. Makaine Too Many Losing Heroines is a comedy and romance anime by A1 Pictures. First of all, the anime looks amazing. Everything is so smooth. A weird praise, but the color palette is so cozy. I don't know how to explain it, but uh, it's really, really nice. The vibe of the anime overall is just really cool. And the animation is actually really good. It really feels like the animators are enjoying making the details. I have yet to see a single one bad frame. It all serves a purpose and it all works in complete harmony. When it comes to the plot, the anime is really fucking funny so it's basically about this dude who ends up eating lunch with this crazy girl who just got i cannot say dumped because she never even dated the guy she just has a crush on him and he has another girlfriend so she's sobbing and crying to the main character and then yeah she doesn't have any money after ordering some of the wildest shit ever i i need to know what the fuck is a watermelon pancake? I need to know about that. Cause to be honest, that sounds fucking delicious. Anyway, so yeah, the dude covered the bill and their relationship is at the start kinda dependent on <laughs> the fact that this dude wants his money back. And yeah, it's it's, it's a still a running gag that the girl is in debt. And bit by bit, you see that the dude is falling in love with this thing and from there starts the romantic mostly comedic story i just want to say this dude's sister she she's like uh how can i explain her oni-chan i live in your walls yep she's literally that she's the creepiest sweet thing i have seen and of course i need to bring this topic because you know everything that makes twitter mad is probably a good thing so behold twitter adult lolly face your nightmares yes the teacher is actually really goddamn cool she doesn't appear much but when she does you know it's a really good scene and i need to talk about something twice this season people get stuck in storage rooms what what is happening i just reacted to shikonokonokonokonkoshtantan and in that episode they also got stuck in a storage room so what are we doing here what is it with storage rooms and high school kids getting stuck inside we need to study this fuck truck kun we have storage room kidnapper for some reason but anyway this anime is simply put very adorable and family friendly what the fuck is happening Yes, I have no idea how heat strokes are supposed to work, but that right there is the best fucking heat stroke I have ever seen. A, if heat stroke makes your girl half naked on the ground, maybe we should start burning people more. Cause holy shit, she also gets amnesia, by the way. <laughs> like everything that happens, just poof. Oh wait, anyway, anyway what, what do we have here? The story is a perfect balance of plot and fan service when you feel like the plot is getting a bit too deep fan service comes crashing in and when fan service starts to get at the end of the rope suddenly plot and not the physical kind of plot the spiritual kind of plot and best example of that is the last scene in episode 3 which was something I did not expect at all. Usually animes wait till the final episode to do something like this, but yeah, it just happened, yeah. Of course it's a cliffhanger, so we, we gotta wait. But yeah, all the characters are very entertaining. Even the side characters, like this one dude in the literature club, he's definitely not a main character, he's just on the side and serves no purpose other than being that short girl's love interest. And even he is really entertaining to watch. Anyway, yeah, that was like a very short review of the first three episodes. And yep, that's about it. Go watch. Get the fuck out.